Welcome to Fans of Sport. Please subscribe to the channel, like the video, and comment in the comment section below. Orlando Pirate will host Richards Bay FC at Orlando Stadium tonight in the Betway Premiership. So far, Orlando Pirate has played six games in the lock. And fortunately for them, they've won all of them. They are on 18 points now. They come into this game with an advantage because they were eliminated in the Culling Knockout Cup by Marquesi FC. Speaking about Marquesi, I'll come back to that point because Orlando Pirate was called by the PSL Disciplinary Committee uh, concerning the incident that happened during their game with Marquesi FC. They were eliminated. So on the, play, on the teams that were playing on Saturday, Orlando Parrot uh, was not there, but Richards Bay was playing. So I'm saying they come with they have an advantage coming to this game because they had enough time to prepare for, for, for the game. In the game where they played against Marquesi, Marquesi uh, scored three goals before half time. Then they were leading Orlando Parrot by, by three goals to nil. Then second half, Parrot did come back. They scored the first goal. And scored the second goal. Towards the end of the game, Orlando Pirates scored the third goal, of which the player was in an offside position. Their assistant referee has raised the flag and said it is an offside. That goal was not allowed. The Orlando Pirates supporters were not pleased, so they misbehaved. Then Orlando Pirate yesterday there to suffer the consequences of that behavior. The Premier Soccer League prosecutor Zola Majavu confirms Pirate has been charged and pleaded guilty for spectators' misconduct in the loss against Marquesi FC. The fine is 100,000 rands, with half of it suspended on condition that the same offense isn't repeated in the next year, meaning they they've paid fifty thousand rands and fifty thousand is suspended for a period of twelve months. If the same incident happened, they, they have to pay that man. If the same incident doesn't happen for the period of twelve months, they don't have to pay that fifty thousand rands. Let's hope the Orlando Pirates fans will behave uh, no matter the results or the outcome of the game. 